All right, fellas. Well, I've already done a video about this, but uh, I'm going to do another one because I'm going to swap out just the injector on the dozer, which is right there. That one right there. So what do you need? What you need is a, a 12 socket and I think it's a 14 socket because there's two nuts. There's one here. You got to hold that one and then you have this one here. This one's your fuel line and that's your injector. So to untie this, you got to hold this one and loosen this one first and then get to the injector. Here's the new injector. I got it at Freightline. It cost me 173 bucks. But uh yeah, I'm gonna swap it out and uh I'll show you guys. So make what sure it looks you like. get yourself a, a wire brush and then stick it into the dozer hole. Dozer hole right there before you uh put your injector in. Clean out the dozer a little bit with this, just stick it in there. And uh, there's your injector, brand new injector right there. Uh, there's a fuel line. Again, uh, the socket for the injector is a 12. The socket for, I mean, the, the box wrench for the injector is a 12. The box wrench for the fuel line is going to be a 14. So you got to hold the injector and unloosen the, the fuel line in order to get to it. So, I mean, you can pull out the injector, clean it out, stick it back in, but it's gonna start, it's gonna start getting, giving you problems, it's gonna start clogging up, so you might as well just replace it and get a brand new one. Again, the injector cost me 173 bucks. Uh, easy job, do it yourself, no problems. Uh, what's the danger in it? None that I can see. So, hope this video was able to help somebody out. We'll see you guys on our next video.